Hi everyone, I want to tell you about an awesome new tool, Microsoft Compliance Configuration Analyzer. It's a PowerShell utility that's going to go out and fetch your tenant's current configuration and validate it against Microsoft 365 recommended best practices. This is really awesome. And so what it's going to do is go out and look at your configuration and then give you some recommendations for products like data loss prevention inside Microsoft Information Protection. It's going to look at all your labeling for sensitivity labels, information governance and records management, so retention labels and those type of things, insider risk management and communications compliance, my favorite product, and audit and e-discovery. Now, a couple things you should be aware of is that uh, to really make this useful, you should have the Microsoft 365 E5 subscription license or E3 plus the E5 add-on. Now, if you don't have those, that's okay. You can still run the tool, but it's going to still report on E5 workloads and capabilities. So how do you do this? Well, let's pull up PowerShell and I'll walk you through it. If you just go out and type install-module MCCA preview and then import it, and then sign into Office 365 here and run git-mcca report. It's going to have you authenticate with somebody who has permissions to run this, and then it's going to go through and fetch all the data from all those different workloads I just described. And at the end of this, it's then going to export this out to a PDF. That's going to look something like this. Now, what I love about this is it's pretty easy to consume, and it's going to give me a printout here. Gray means that there's some recommendations. Yellow means I can make some improvements. And green means that I'm okay. And so if we scroll through this, here you can see some of the improvements I can make, like create some DLP policies. And you can see that I need to go out and create some sensitivity labels and use IRM and Exchange Online. And I should probably consider applying some record labels. And uh, as far as communications compliance goes, I probably want to consider doing uh, offensive and, and threatening language monitoring across Teams and, and email. And I may also want to look at insider risk management to see if there's any nefarious employees out there trying to leak data or steal data. So again, this is really awesome. I will put a link in the video description to the GitHub repo where you can find this and then also a link to the PowerShell gallery. Uh, but that shouldn't really matter because, again, if you just import the module or install it directly here inside PowerShell, you'll be able to get up and running in no time. All right, thanks, everybody. I hope you love this as much as I do. We'll see you in the next video. Take care.